When you get a diagnosis of depression, you might expect it to tell you something important about what's happening in your body. Like, what's wrong? Why is it happening? Or what does the future hold for me with this diagnosis? But the truth is, it doesn't tell you any of that. Unlike other medical conditions where a diagnosis points to a clear biological issue, a depression diagnosis doesn't tell you if something is pathologically wrong with you. That's why there's no brain scans or blood tests out there to confirm it. Instead, it's based on a set of symptoms you report. And because of that, it doesn't explain why you are having those symptoms. And here's the other thing. When you get a diagnosis of depression, it doesn't give you any insight into what's going to happen next. For instance, with a condition like Parkinson's, you can predict the course of the illness after you get the diagnosis. But with depression, the diagnosis doesn't predict your future. Two people who get this diagnosis can have widely different experiences in the long term. So what does this all mean? Well, it means that a depression diagnosis is just a label for what you're experiencing in the moment. And it only scratches the surface without uncovering the deeper causes of your symptoms or even informing you on the best way to recover.